Before we take a tour of our assets with our COO, I'd like to touch upon the integration of the recent Semifo and Taranga acquisitions. We have rapidly integrated those assets within our West African operating platform. And as mentioned during our Q1 webcast, we're on track to realize nearly $100 million of synergies. One of the key factors for our successful integration has been the people aspect. Our staff has grown by 80% over the last year alone. I therefore sat down with Henri, our EVP of people, to discuss this in more detail, and particularly how we approached making our new employees feel part of the Endeavor family. For those of you who haven't met Henri, he is based in Abidjan and is probably the EVP who spends the most time on site. You've integrated two businesses last year. Our workforce has nearly doubled. What's been the biggest success factor in being able to integrate so many people so quick within our culture? The key word is humility and not trying to uh, just copy paste what you did before to the new acquired assets. So, you know, we have started by clearly understanding, you know, the culture of these assets. Uh, they, have, they operated in a different way as ours. So it was not about to tell them, guys, you know, you did that before, it's going to change now. So uh, we have adjusted our operating model, did not change its DNA, because we strongly believe that uh, we need to have a decentralized model with you know, strong policies, guidelines, to have consistency across the group and to make sure that we deliver our objective. But more importantly is to create a common culture and common references and for the people and for the workforce to see all the opportunities that are linked uh, by the fact of belonging to a, a larger group. We just want to take the best out of the two worlds, to create one world. So social license to operate, it means a lot of things to a lot of people. But what does it mean from a HR perspective? It's something that we have to deliver on, on a daily basis. It's not only a concept, you know. And the way I see it, you know, it starts with the, the recruitment strategy. So we have, you know, uh, very long processes and policies on the, on the matter. But I would summarize it by, you know, the closer, the better. We always uh, try to uh, promote people internally first when we have a vacant position. So the interest of being a group because, you know, it increases uh, the number of opportunities within the group, which means a lot of internal communication and HR speaking to each other so as to identify potential candidates to take another position in another site and to be promoted. And then, you know, we hire externally, but we first hire in the country. And uh, that's only if we do not find that we uh, enlarge the search in West Africa or uh, internationally. How do you make this happen? So first we have a team in Abidjan, uh, the regional HR team that provides support and assistance to Mindsight on daily issues, daily matters, as well as making sure that our strategic pillars are well applied across the board. So the strategic pillars, there are four. One is Endeavor Care, which was created you know, three or four years ago and it's, uh, the original intention was to make sure that each and every employee is covered by a medical insurance, him, her, and the family. So that was the first uh, step, and now we have enlarged it to uh, make sure that we have a positive mindset across the board around health and safety. So we have a lot of communication and we work together with the HSC department to make the Endeavor Care program the one that highlights everything that needs to be done to make sure that we uh, operate safely. Uh, the second program that we have uh, launched is the Endeavor Next program. It is to make sure that for every critical position we have identified successors and a program to train them to make sure that they are ready to take the position. It's called the Endeavor Academy. So we have a lot of ambition around the Endeavor Academy program, which is about partnering with schools. It's about, you know, soft skills, art skills, knowledge transfer, skill transfers, and uh, we are going to launch uh, soon an online platform um, on the matter. And at the end, I think perhaps uh, for some people this is the most important program, which is the Endeavor Rewards program, is to make sure that we pay the people, you know, the right amount and we have the right compensation scheme in place, uh, uh, best salary, short-term incentive plan, long-term incentive plan, all aligned with uh, the objective of, uh, of the company. So that's where you know, we put in place you know, the short-term incentive plan program that cover every employee within the group, from the CEO to the lowest level of the organization. So we have consistency across the board, and we try to have you know, this consistency being ensured by a strong HR network 
that communicate each other so as to break down barriers between mindsets. You know, we don't want to be the sum of the part. We want to be a group. We have a, a duty to uh, to hire locally, and uh, we are very proud of. For example, you know, we have reduced the number of expats at both Bungu and Mana by 40% in less than a year. Uh, so the objective is not to oppose expats versus nationals. We are all Endeavour employees. But when you are an expatriate, we believe that you have an additional duty to train, to mentor, to transfer skills and knowledge to uh, identify successors. So it's a very important part of our HR strategy, and I think it's a very important part of our social license to operate. How would you define our culture today? We have you know, a very diverse team, workforce, 52 nationalities, different horizon. We wanted to articulate, you know, what are the main features that define Endeavor. The four P's, partners, pioneers, proactive, performers. So every time we take a decision, within the decision-making process, we need to make sure that the four P's are in the room. So Henri, you, you spend a lot of time on site, but I think the person who now spends the most time on site is Goldie. Ah, Goldie. Goldie is our mascot, and Goldie is a f vector to communicate things in a positive way on mind site. Uh, and uh, not to uh, just like uh, tell people that they are prohibited from doing X and Y for safety reasons, but communicate in a much more positive way. So it's a kind of a funny character that uh, is everywhere uh, across the board and that give a kind of a, a tone uh, uh, positive and nice tone uh, at Endeavor. You mentioned diversity earlier. How is this integrated within your HR strategy? That's a very important point, Partino. I think it's very important that uh, everyone at the, uh, within the organization, not only HR, is uh, knows that he has to deliver on the matter, on the diversity. Diversity cannot only be the matter of HR. It should be the matter of everybody. So we have a lot of communication around that. Uh, every month, monthly uh, reviews, you know, business reviews. This is part of the KPIs that we track, and this is, you know, part of our, our incentive program as well. You know, for example, last year, we targeted to uh, reach 10% of our workforce being women. We were at eight, so it was a kind of an ambition, a big step, and we managed it. And you know, on top of you know reaching the 10%, internal communication by just saying, you know. Everyone is incentivized on the fact that we need to reach that, sends a very strong message internally. Now that the integrations are complete, what's next? I think, you know, what next is just like, you know, what makes our DNA, which is, you know, attracting, retaining talents. Uh, and more importantly, I think, is to make sure that every employee at, uh, at Endeavor, whatever his position or opposition is, is happy in the morning to go to work. I think it's very important to have a very positive attitude, positive uh, f feedback from the people, and to have you know people making sure, knowing that they can grow, they can have opportunities with Endeavor, and that they have a future with Endeavor. If you'd like to learn more, I invite you to watch the Meet Our People and Ask the Experts video series on our website.